Previously on AMC's The Walking Dead. Neither of us are. Oh, damn, you've got a little girl. I'm oh, sorry about that. Why did they shoot him? It smells like... Shit. <gasps> I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that. <laughs> that was a swear. Get the fuck out of here! Uh, okay. Oh boy. Well, this is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. Save all of them, huh? That's oh well. Look. Hey there, you friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Hi there. Fuck. Oh, maybe saving the kid wasn't the best Help! idea. Ah, no! Is he really dying? Okay, he's not dead yet. I was about to be really mad. Who's... Run! Is that Maggie? Maggie and Glenn? We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die, either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? They would have died out there. We have kids with us. I see one little girl. What is it? I... I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. Yeah. And we appreciate it. Now let's settle down. Yeah. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. What the Over hell? my dead body. We'll dig one hole. No. I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle it. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody oh, no. threatens my boy. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, oh. we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. His ass. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. <laughs> upsetting is getting eaten alive. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? Oh. She's United States Air Force. Oh, fuck you and her. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Key's behind the counter. Probably. Oh. oh. 
Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll turn fast. And then, there'll be three. Then we deal with it then. But right now, we're just yeah. freaking everybody out. And get ready to deal with it, because that boy is it's bitten. not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! No, this fucking guy. No! You don't touch that boy! You don't touch anybody! I've got a little girl I'm trying to protect in here, too. You wanna get violent, you old fuck? Well, come <laughs> on! You better have a plan to kill me, though, because it's me before anyone else in here! <laughs> Jesus! Clementine! What, what am I doing? Come on, dude! Get, get, get up! Help her! Get away from her, you son of a bitch! Get up! Fuck you! Man. You okay? You're just great, thanks. Yeah, man. Uh, guys? Everybody down! Stay quiet! <laughs> That's peace. They're gonna get in! Shut up! Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. Oh, that was this uh, guy. Uh, uh, Dad! Uh, 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 uh. The fuck is he having a heart attack? What's wrong with it? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. We'll get in there somehow. Thank you so much. Yeah, we'll do it we tomorrow. need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Nitroglycerin Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. Yeah. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Boss. Now get him those pills. He became the boss? Oh, shit. Alright, we need to get into the pills somehow. What is this? Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. <laughs> You're a pretty good shot. Yeah. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter. Especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. <laughs> oh, yeah. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. No. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me. Oh. And I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. That guy saved you? Yeah. Can you believe it? 
Those creeps or, or ghouls or whatever the hell they are. Creeps they were pulling our ghouls. van apart and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kind of cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. <laughs> what are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Probably all the batteries is stupid bit. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? Do you know that there are no batteries in that thing? Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. <laughs> no. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. What's that? This was my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My dad gave it to me. Like See, dad's just smart like that. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Move it. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Yeah, yeah, I know. Move. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Mm. Things have been scary, huh? Yeah. It's not good. I don't know why everyone is crazy. Neither do I, Clementine. Nobody does, I don't yeah, think. Yeah. I bet my dad does. Okay, here we go. <laughs> do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Let's not talk about that. Do you play sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. Oh. I'm not crazy about it either. All right, a little further. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? <laughs> Do they like hate I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. Just is. But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. Yeah. yeah. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I got into some trouble, and, and I didn't talk to them for a while. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay, because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. Now, uh, let's get this done. Yeah. Let's get this done. I, I think Ow! she likes me. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. <laughs> I'll find you a bandage. Maybe there are actually some in the drawer, though. No? Well, I know this is a first aid kit there. Yeah? Take that. Yeah, see, we got the bandage. Alright, okay, I got you. There. Let's have a look at that finger. Yeah. How? It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. Yeah, let's get that covered up. I think she likes me. You see, I'm a nice guy. Lee? Yeah? 
What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. Well, we should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Yeah. I protect you, little one. <laughs> I missed him though. No, what is he doing? So me. Find anything? It's a photo of the family yeah. who own this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Oh. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? What's it to you? To me? I'm not the one with the felony record. You seem like an okay guy. And the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. Yeah. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Thanks. Don't worry about it. I'm a nice guy, you know? Get down! Did you see that? I sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh, man. I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn! Right then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her, with or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's save the damsel in distress. Something we got to work with. We can do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fella lurking near the front. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. That was sick. That's not how it works. That's not how it works. Um, you stack? 
there we're here to help please just go away let's go guys in a minute if you open up we can take you somewhere safer we've got a group in town no 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 please. she's in trouble no. miss we're coming in Get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die, and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? What? <laughs> I don't want that. It's not Christian. Please, just leave me. Please go. Okay, we'll leave. Just try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me. I can just... You know, end this, and then, then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. We'll, we'll get the problem. We can't let you do that to yourself. Then do it for me. We need to get going. Give it to me, please. This is crazy. Please, step back. It's just two seconds, just one bullet. Oh, no. And I can be with my family, and it'll all be no, fine. No, 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 no. Yes. Just Back up. Please! Oh, no. Are they gonna fall? No. Whoa! Ah! Oh my god. Why? Whoa, take it easy. We just want to help. No, no, you no, can't. No, no, no. Miss, just relax now. You need to think this through. Yeah. We'll find you a doctor. It'll be okay. Let's all just... Oh, no! 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 Oh, no. A lot of noise. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. Let's get out of here. Shit! Here they come! Get in! You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while. 